Welcome back Pokefans to the playthrough of Pokemon Reunion. So last episode we ended up battling Brock in Pewter City to get permission from the police to go to Cerulean City. They basically escorted us. Then we explored Cerulean City and went to the police headquarters, spoke to Looker who basically told us that the ultra wormholes are the cause of everything that's going on and they are very dangerous they're on a need to know basis with people and we've joined the dimension squad or d squad for sure and have been given a special badge so we can now investigate these wormholes and apparently there's one just up on nugget bridge so we're going to go and do that now oh is that a dimensional squad badge i see you can go through then take care trainer You can feel the atmosphere changing. Something seems to be approaching. Ah, oh, it's you. I'm sure you'll grass steel. Pretty sure you are. I'm about to find out. Maybe you're not. You might be grass flying actually. Okay then well to make sure I connect I'm just gonna flare blitz. Mm, didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. Just live. Creature escaped. So that's not even the wormhole that we needed to go through. Man, that's annoying. It's all good though, we can just run back and heal. So. Where's the one? Maybe it's up near Bill's house. Oh no, there it is. Alright, I'll check down here first. Let's see what the encounters are here as well. Alright, so that's Aegis Slash. That Milsery. Lycan Rock. I'm not sure what that one is. A level 11 gloom. Pretty sure that's illegal. Can't be that low level. Also, are we going to at some point get like Pokemon from level 5, do you reckon? Oh, it's Bound Sweet. Okay. Why are we going to catch a level 12 Pokemon though? Well, I'm just heading up here because I want to see if there's anything up here. You never know, could go through that wormhole and not come back for a long time. Also, is Bill's house not up here no more? Oh, Vileplume. I think I'm going to use a repel. Just so I can get through here a bit quicker. Oh, wow. Looks a lot different to what it used to. Oh, he's on a trip. Well, that was kind of a wasted journey, but oh well. Um, 
let's just you must be a famous red everyone's talking about look at Tommy you were coming are you ready we'll let you borrow the ultra wormhole borrow it you won't be able to come back here until you found the portal on the other side are you well prepared right then good luck new D squad member actually before while I think about that I'm gonna go back to the mark because I need to get some supplies I think Yeah, we could probably do with buying some um, potions and stuff. Got a decent amount of money. Get two of them. Probably get two full restores. Oh, wow, I can buy max survives as well. Um. Just the nugget to sell, isn't it? For five thousand. There we go. We can get one max revive. Just because you never know when you're going to need it. And now I think we're all ready to go and conquer this wormhole. Let's head on in then. Feel space tearing, tearing before your eyes. Enter the ultra wormhole. Oh, who's that? Is that the person from the beginning? Yo, where are we? Don't get in our way. Out of my sight. Um, we're in Gala. Spike Meth is our turf. Team yells everywhere these days. So much more convenient to have a Pokemon Center and a Mart in one place. Other regions must envy us. Just got dumped by my girlfriend for a new guy. That's okay, it's an event that had to happen to make me stronger. Call it Cannon Event. And what about you? Have you ever had any crazy events in your life? Tell us about it. Okay. Can't wait to see where Chairman Rose's tournament takes us this year. Although I would have preferred a martial arts tournament. Okay then, so. What are we going to encounter in Gala? Life is a very un unique in Spike Math. You have to be used to it, otherwise you quickly feel out of place. In Spike Math, where. He he he, what are you doing here? Start right there, you're going to give me everything you've got. And fast. Huh? Do you want to? Are you looking for trouble or what? Yeah, bring it. Alright, have it your way. Team Yell, there. Isn't Marnie like their leader? I mean, isn't Spike Meth where Pierce was the um, champion, I think? Like Lipard. So I could. Do, I suppose Vespiquen could do quite well here, but we'll just break break. And Pangora. You can also get brick broke. You obviously eat it a little bit better there. I don't know why you'd give me Iron Fist as your ability though. Wow, that's weird. Yeah, now I think about it, you use dark types, don't you, so probably be wise to go Vespiquen. Pay no attention to the members of Team Yeah. They like to attract attention. Wonder when the next Champions Tournament will be held. I want to see our leader shine again. She's so strong. Even if Pierre's the former leader and brother of our current leader, Quite strong. I have the impression that his sister surpasses him by far. Okay, and so Marnie's going to be the leader there. I suppose it makes sense. We agree, Team Yell, so cool. No. Excuse me, you asked for this. I 
Come on and bring it on. So I'm assuming we just have to clear these and maybe talk to Marnie and that's what we have to do to get through this wormhole. Also, your Lipar's level 86. Oh my god, best speaker, and that is shocking. You can't even one shot a life pod. That probably KOs. Okay, let's go Charizard. Charizard can then air slash. That's resisted. Still did a good chunk of damage though. Air slash. Not quite doing enough. Please don't paralyze. Please don't paralyze. I think they all literally have the same Pokemon. A Lipard and a Pangora. But yeah, Vespiquen, you suck. So, next one. You can't get any of these house coming now. Ha ha ha, look at that dumb hat you got on you. You're pitiful. You make me want to mingle. Aren't you going to say anything? You're going to worship me stupidly now. Do you want to make out or what? Well, you got it to get out of here. Oh, you can actually avoid them. Oh, this one's different. We team yellow the law here. You got a problem with that? Oh, we're a rebel. I'll show you what we're made of. We don't like clowns here. Why you got all that stuff in your face then? This one's actually got a picture of Marnie. <coughs> exactly the same though, level 86 light pod. Um, let's bug buzz. Still not going to one-shot, is it? I mean, it's a little bit closer. Still going to have to switch to Charizard. I mean, the one good benefit is... Oh, okay, Weavile. Well, we can't go into Charizard for that. Let's just hope that Pikachu can live two hits. I don't think it does. Never mind, we outspeed. I thought Weavile was supposed to be fast. Okay, I'll stop, sorry. I suppose it is worth taking these guns out because of the money as well. More money means more supplies. Also, I want to know who those are to the left, because I don't remember them from Galar. They're obviously a new team. What's about this one? So big guy renovating the arena. We'll have to turn back. Right, here's Marnie. Are you a trainer? Never seen you around. So you gave Team Yellow a good fresh in. Don't hold it against them. They've got a good heart. Don't realize they can be intense sometimes. But you may just take them on one by one. I guess it's time for me to put your skills to the test personally. I have to show my fans how to do it right. I'm a spike myth leader after all. Come on. Alright. Just a bit like a, like a gym battle. 
five Pokemon. Starting off with, let me guess, a Lipard. Let's see what you can do. I'm pretty strong, so don't hold back. Not gonna hold back, I hope you're ready. To be honest, I don't really mind you going for Sucker Punch. Oh, we got a crit. I will definitely take that. Okay, stronger, get it, but try your luck against this one. Right, let's go, Snorlax. Go ahead, send me what you want, I'll give it my all. Okay, that's kind of cheating. Oh, isn't that a physical move, actually, now I think about it. Oh, my God. This little rascal. It's Max Potion. See how much this does. Yeah, we, we live another one as long as we don't get crit. Ah, uh, you miss your super thing. You suck. Right, two down. What we got next? Toxicroak. Oh, man. Um... You know what, Snorlax, I'm gonna have to let you go down here. Sorry. Hey, just guess for Sucker Punch. It's like you can take care of yourself even without Dynamax, that's cool. Okay, let's get you to burn these. That's two four stars. To be fair, we're going to run out of um, Earthquake soon. There we go, there's the gunk shot. Don't disappoint me, you look strong. Don't make me change my mind. Right, Charizard, come on. you got to outspeed the Tatsu Croak. Ah, I forgot Sucker Punch. And it crits us as well. <clears throat> That's annoying. Out comes Scrafty. Oh my god, that took so much damage. You got leftovers. Come on, crit. Ah, oh, the flinch clutch. Dragon Claw just to make sure I hit you. Let's take it seriously, otherwise, it won't last long. I think you only got one Pokemon left, didn't you? And it's a Grim Snarl. Which, to be honest, I'm just going to try and Fire Blast. See how much it does. It's got to do at least half. Right, Venusaur, you're up. Sludge Bomb, finish you off. That's a cool battle. You're pretty good, actually. Hmm, that was quite the beating I took. But I'm not mad, you're a good guy and you know how to fight. That's fine with me. You look a bit out of place here anyways. Where are you from? Marnie, Marnie. What's wrong? What are you screaming about? You got a problem? It's crazy Marnie, there's a Pokemon outside who's Gigantamaxed. You've got to get to the entrance or it'll tear the whole place down. What? Again? I'll be right there. Alright. Looks like we head to where Marnie's gone. 
Oh yeah, look at them all bunched up. Right, we'll heal up and then we'll um We'll go and help out. Uh, I think I'm gonna lead with Venusaur though. Don't get in our way. What are you doing here? Get out of the way, I have to get through. Negative. No one's authorised to intervene at this time. That's right, what happens out there is beyond your reach. Please be patient. Patient? You want me to wait until my city gets demolished? Are you out of your mind? Affirmative. Please wait until the destruction is complete. Oh, there you are. What took you so long? So, can you do me a favour? I could use a hand getting these two out of the way. If you don't get out of the way, I'm going to have to make you. My town's in danger and I'm certainly not going to stand around doing nothing. Alright then, double that it is. Ooh, who's this? Can't quite make out what that is. But they're called... Team Kronos. That's pretty cool. They look cool as well actually. Ah, okay, then we'll use ghost types. Right, <clears throat> I think Cursola is... Ghost Rock, but I'm going to Leech Seed anyway. Oh. Well, that's a bit pointless now. And you got a special defense drop, great. In comes Drift Bloom. Um, right, let's go Pikachu. You carry on doing your thing, Lifeguard. I'll just be the supporting act. That didn't do much. Ah, oh, and it's just gone for a tailwind. Alright, oh, poor curse on me. Why wouldn't you try and take down the Lifeguard? You gotta be kidding me. You've actually gotta be kidding me. I can't believe that that thing's just gone and exploded. Right then, Chandelier. You're all just gonna eat crunches. Dusclops is finally gone. That's got to be on the light part here. Toxic Rogue. Oh, it's just the one Pokemon left there. That's probably KO'd. Oh no, it lives on like 1 HP. Okay, all done. Mission failed, however, everything's going according to plan. This wasn't supposed to happen, but no matter, we've brought enough time. Enjoy your last moments. What, did you see that? They vanished right in front of our eyes. I can't believe that. Oh, but I've got to get out there. Well, we'll join you. We'll just quickly heal up again first. So, you got... The Karasu gang and the Kronos gang. Obviously the Kronos gang are in Galar though. Right, we got... Oh, there's actually Raid Dens as well. What Pokemon appear here? Morpeko and Graplock. Quite a few actually. Oh, there's a Raid Den. Two XP candy XLs. I think that's it. I'll take care of this one, tourist. Look around and make sure there aren't any others running wild. Oh, okay, so. We just take down Raid Denser. 
TM64 Avalanche. Is it actually going to be a raid then as well? Okay. It's a Blastoise. Um, can I leech seed it? I wonder. No, it doesn't affect it. Okay. We just have to keep... Oh, that's probably one shot, mate. Ooh. That's resisted. Good job, really. Flash cannon, I think we just about live. Actually, yeah, we live that quite comfortably. You see, if we get hit with an ice cream, then we're screwed. Thankfully, the AI is not very smart. Although you'll probably ice beam now. It's filled with rage, what does that mean? Does that mean he gets a guaranteed crit? So it could possibly be that we've got to fight three Kanto G Max forms. Um, oh, there's a person here. Really inspired here, even if it's a bit of a wild atmosphere all around. Oh, I didn't realise it was going to be a trainer. I wouldn't have bothered, um... Okay, um... Snorlax, you're a special wall. You should be able to absorb two hits off this and then EQ delete it. That's what I'm hoping, anyway. Oh yeah, that was a crit as well. Although poison job's gonna hurt. Ooh. Just the one Pokemon as well. I don't really want to use all my potions. I'd like to launch a Dynamax Rage, yeah. There's only one more after this anyway. Suppose I'll heal after this, and yeah, it's a Venusaur. This one's actually probably going to be harder to take out now I think about it. Oh my god, that did so little damage. Like that is doing nothing. I only hope, and it's got a Giga Drain. Oh, it's just got all that HP back. Right, best we can. Don't let me down. That's quad resisted. We eat that. We eat that. Oh yeah, this is going to be a long battle, especially if you keep missing attacks. See, I'm thinking of going Bug Buzz, because at least that gives us a chance to drop its um, special defense. To be fair, it does 
probably just as much. You mean to tell me the whole time? And it poisons me, great. Okay, as long as we connect, we should be good. You gotta be kidding me, man. What sobriety water it is. I feel like we should get something for beating these raids as well. Right, just flare blitz it. Alright then, let me quickly run back and heal and then we'll carry on. Alright then, we're back. Um, can't go that way, there's a policeman in the way, so it's definitely up here. Situation's under control. If you refuse to leave the premises, I'll have to force you. Alright, Jenny, keep your ear on. Do you not know we're the Dimensional Squad? Oh, Maractus, that's good for us. So I went ahead and taught Charizard Rock Slide, which I didn't know it could actually learn, but it does. Um, got rid of Dragon Claw just because I feel like Dragon Claw's. Ah, oh, we missed. Your Dragon Claw's a little bit redundant because if we're going against dragons, I'd just rather go with ice moves. And obviously, we're going to be fighting a G Max Charizard, or. I thought we were. Oh, look, it's a more Pekka. I don't know why the um the music changes so drastically. And a cramorant. So it's all sword and shield Pokemon. Aha, uh -huh, citrus bows. I don't know, there gotta be some up there. Okay, I think got enough berries, thank you. Speaking of citrus berries, I'm gonna go ahead and give a few around. Especially Snorlax, it'll be really useful on Snorlax. Um, so where's this last raid then? Ah, okay. It's here. That didn't sound like a Charizard. Oh, here it is. It looks so cool. I hope it's still f flying types. Well. See, this one has flamethrower. Why couldn't we have flamethrower? That's a crit. Wow. Okay. This isn't going to go as planned. I've got a feeling it's lost its flying type, you know, because a four times super effective move should be doing way more than that. I like how you can connect focus blasts and I'm um, missing rock slides. Right, heal one time. Probably don't really need to, but you just never know. It's got dragon breath as well. And it, that's three for three now, I think, on focus blasts. Insane. Alright then, let's go and see what Marnie's got to say. Is everything alright? Were you successful on your side? Great. Thank you, really. In the name of all the Spike Math, you've been a great help. 
Wonder why those Pokemon started Dynamaxing like that for no reason. Apparently some of them have also Dynamaxed in Hammerlock, but Leon should be able to handle that. You look really lost, is this your first Dynamax fight or what? You don't even have a Dynamax band. You were gym challenging and you decided to go without. You remind me of my brother, he's anti-Dynamax too. But it's pretty classy I must admit. By the way, let me introduce myself. I'm Marnie, the new Spike Muff gym leader. Nice to meet you and what's your name? What was that noise? Sound like it was coming from the beach. Let's go, I need to make sure no one is in trouble. Aw oh, man. That sounded like another Dynamax then. Which, if that's the case, we definitely need to be healed. Oh, I could be wrong and it could be those bad guys. But, I'm probably alluding more to the fact it's Dynamax Den. Because I'm pretty sure I saw one on the beach as well. Oh no, it was a wormhole. What the hell is this? It's incredible. I've never seen anything like it. You seem to know what it is, don't you? Why don't you explain to me? Who are you really? You were training without a Dynamax band and you clearly don't know your way around. What's this thing for? You won't tell, will you? Can I at least have your first name? Red, that's a funny name, but okay, Red. If you know what this thing is for, I won't take up too much of your time asking questions. Do what you have to do. Thanks for the help, Red. I hope we'll meet again. Alright, just head on back through. And we're on Route 25, but Bill's still on that trip, so let's go ahead and report back to Lucker about our successful first mission. Why did they have to put grass on this little, what's it called, like, return? It's supposed to be a shortcut. Right then, the first mission as a D squad member has been successful. To the basement. I never checked to see if there was anything on here. No. Alright, just report back to Lucker then. I knew it. From the moment I saw your eyes the first time we met, I was sure I could trust you. I'll send of your victory, your triumph. Well done, Red. So tell me quickly what happened out there. I see. Giant Pokemon. A town called Spikemouth. And strange individuals. My suspicions are growing. I thought the cause of these ultra wormholes was external. Thank you, Red. Your help was very helpful. Mission accomplished. You completed your first mission. Here's your reward. Three X potions. Max for five. A nugget, which we can sell to get more. For now, just rest. We'll move on to the second mission when you're ready. Unfortunately, the ultra wormholes are starting to appear in large numbers. Come and see me when you're ready. I mean, we'll leave that for next episode. So, yeah. Next episode, we'll see what the second mission's all about. But, um, yeah, enjoying it so far. It's quite intriguing. Obviously, going to different regions as well. Sounds pretty cool. But yeah, thank you everyone for watching. And I hope to see you all next time.